Hi, I'm Bob Allison, WV1GCM here at the ARL Laboratory. You read Joel Hallis's review on the Tentec 418. Now I bet you want to see it. And here it is, the Tentec 418. It's a 100 watt linear amplifier. Let's take a peek underneath here. It's a little foot stand. Prop it up, makes it easier to view. There's the front panel on off, antenna one, antenna two switch, two antennas on the back, and another uh, six meter antenna port. I'll show you more about the screen in a moment. Let's rotate it around, show you the back here. This is your input from your radio, one HF antenna, second HF antenna, and the six meter antenna here. Accessory port, you can key the transmitter here, and it looks for data uh, from some HF transceivers. Uh, a key in and a key out here for transceivers and timing, your ground connection, your fuse, and your Anderson power pole DC connection. Let's fire it up. On it goes. And we certainly have a pleasing blue display here. 100 to 10 to 100 watts power output graph, SWR graph here as well. 13.7 volts input DC. And that's your attenuator setting. Uh, 0, 2, 4, or 6 dB, that's at the input. So with a 6 dB setting at the input for attenuation, you can run up to 20 watts uh, from your exciter. Uh, temperature at the final amplifier, and uh, I have about 3 watts on the exciter. I'll key the uh, amplifier on the accessory key here. Now let's see what it does with about 3 watts in. Hmm, about 60 watts out. Now you can expect with this amplifier to run uh, a little more power with your QRP rig, like the MFJ Cub for instance, which puts out about a watt and a half, 1.6 watts, and you can get about 40 watts out with an amplifier like this. I fired it up with my 40 meter uh, AM handy talkie, walkie talkie, and guess what? I got about 18 watts out of that. So this is a handy amplifier for all sorts of QRP transceivers. QRP is a lot of fun. It's amazing what you can do with a couple of watts, but near the end of that cue, so what happens sometimes? Well, the bands change and signals start to fade, and you want to finish up that cue, so that's when the Tentec 418 comes through for you. I'm Bob Allison, WB1GCM, ARL test engineer here at the ARRL Laboratory.